Hello, Heather. Hello, hello, my friend. How are you? I'm good. How are you doing? Oh, I'm doing so well. And I just want to tell you this, you know, I know it's so unfortunate that we've got coronavirus and uh, it's a really real thing for a lot of people. But one of the silver linings that I have been experiencing, and I've shared this with a lot of the people in my tribe, is that I'm meeting some of the most amazing, wonderful, inspirational wellness leaders. And I'm so happy that I've got you as a new friend. And really, we've really connected within the last few months, wouldn't you say? Yeah, yeah definitely. We're both just women on a mission to help other women, um, you know, just have better lives, right? Yeah, and remove the complication and remove the chaos, remove the clutter, and just really go back to basics. And it doesn't have to be hard. Mm -hmm. And of course, you want to be using products that are going to be limiting your toxic load. I was just part of a, a um, you know, a massive summit talking just about that, how to take the toxins out of our beauty routine. And when you simplify things, that's what's going to happen. But I would say, you know, for you, I, one of your biggest challenges was like, what do I do? Where do yeah. I start? Yes. And, and also I just want to say I'm 45 years old and I sometimes there's that thought of like, how do I not know? Right. But I don't. And so I'm super excited for today's session. This is going to be really, really fun. I, um, so I've got the box right here. I did open the top box. Just so I can <laughs> do that right here. But um, as somebody who's 40, like really, truly really 45 years old, and it's like, gosh, you know, I don't have the skin that I had when I was 20. And I was a lifeguard way back in, way, way back, and just love the sun always have loved the sun. I'm even getting outside now. It's just so good for mental stability. It's just good for well-being. It's a huge part of my self-care routine. Um, but I'm super excited to just be more intentional mm -hmm. about my skincare. It's, I don't want a complicated routine, but an intentional routine. And then I have the peace of mind knowing that I am doing the best I can. Mm -hmm. And not an expensive routine, right? You don't need to be spending your whole month's food budget <laughs> on your skincare. And, you know, I've done a couple consultations for some lovely ladies today and they're telling me like they're using like two or three serums in the day and they're like over hundred dollars each. And then they got their moisturizer and two different sunscreens and like a morning and nighttime cleanser. It's like, who can afford that? <laughs> And it, it's just crazy. So it's like, pare things down, get some guidance. I'm happy to help. Uh, and for me to give back to you and, you know, talk with you about this and hang out and share some skin guidance and some health tips along the way, that really lights me up. So thank you for, for working with me and oh. asking for my guidance here. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Well, it's not only for me, but it's for everybody else who signed up as well. I know I'm not the only one that wants the guidance here. And so, Rachel, can we just start off with actually, um, we met briefly a few months ago in San Diego, but you're not from San Diego. I'm not from San Diego. I'm from Colorado, as, as the people on my newsletter know, uh, from Colorado, an aspiring minimalist. I try and remove the chaos and complexity away from everything and just get back to basics when it's regarding wellness. Well, frankly, when it's regarding everything. And so will you just share a little bit about your background? Um, I did share a little bit about you, but not much. Sure. So I'm a board certified aesthetic nurse specialist. Basically, that means I'm an RN with advanced specialty board certification in proactive aging and rejuvenation strategies. And of course, I work with products and procedures that are backed by research. And I've been doing this for nearly a decade, about 18,000 procedures. And I love teaching other physicians and nurses and people who just really want to find out what's right for them. And I love writing academic articles. Mm. I won an award on my last published article, which is really cool. Just adding to the body of science and knowledge and uh, just to help other people. So there's lots of people like me out there that want to help people like you, but there's also lots of clinics that are just looking to make a quick buck. They're offering, you know, 
laser treatments or, or other things that just might not be very safe or they might be too expensive for the results that you're hoping to get mm -hmm. or the downtime is too much or you know many other factors so what it comes down to is what lights me up is to help you know lovely men and women all over the world figure out what's a great simple skincare routine to do at home what are some of the other great at-home options too like at-home dermal rolling light therapy things like that and then really what we can do in the clinic but what you do at home I find is actually even more important yes mm -hmm. yes and and more important probably more important and just so powerful like it, it and probably not too complicated either right it doesn't have to be complicated <laughs> no. No. well I'll tell you for the last decade I've been really intentional about the things that I've been eating mm -hmm. and it's been tremendous for me and so I used to be on numerous uh, just numerous pharmaceuticals and never felt really great until I changed my diet and then changed my lifestyle. Yeah. And when I did that, I was able to get off all of these pharmaceuticals, felt so much better. And I thought, wow, well, if I am being really intentional about how I'm nourishing myself, the foods that I'm putting into my body, I actually should be pretty intentional about how I'm nourishing my skin as well, right? We all know the skin absorbs everything. And so it's one of those things that's like, okay, if your skin is absorbing things, it's just like you're kind of eating it, right? And it's showing things. So during times where we might be experiencing a little bit more stress or a little bit more trauma or things in the world are quote unquote, just a little bit chaotic, it is going to show up in the skin. So I am having a bit of like a flurry of patients and clients coming to me online be like, oh, my skin is like freaking out. It's dry. It's rough. I'm breaking out more. What do I do? Give me some help. And so I'm happy to help. And I've been working with people online all over the world, figure out their great at home and in clinic options. So yeah, we were able to take the time and do that. Yeah. Will you share your website? rachelvarga.ca rachelvarga.ca ca for canada <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, you actually have a really cool gift to share with everyone yeah. and i let everybody know awesome uh, if you watch and join the fun that rachel is allowing you all to use a discount 15 percent off if you use the words simply full so i just said two words it's really just one word Simply Full. And why the word Simply Full? Simply Full is one of my memberships. It is a sisterhood of women across the US, Canada, Australia, and Europe. And it is my whole body wellness and weight loss membership. And so Rachel so kindly decided to not only offer this discount to my sisterhood, but to anybody and everybody who follows me. And so thank you all for following me. Maybe you found me through um, one of the essays I wrote or through an online health summit. But regardless, you're here and we are delighted. So I think we should get unboxing. What do you think? Yeah, this sounds like a lot of fun. So open things up, ask me some questions. I'm here to guide you. I'm here to help you. Right. First off, it's so fun to open a box with cute <laughs> tissue paper. Right now, we need to find as many silver linings as we can. True. And experience is everything. And it doesn't, again, like, it doesn't have to be crazy complicated or expensive, but just from the heart, sincere and sweet. Mm -hmm. Love it. So here is my little Rachel Barkey card. Aww. Love it. I handwrite these for everybody. I love, I think handwritten notes are so great right now, just to really give us that sense of connection and and all of that. I do too. I have to tell you, my mom, she just sent both of my boys separate cards and they're eight and nine years old. And so they opened them up and Aww. read the cards and it was just, it was really, really sweet and touching. So, okay. So I'm going to go one at a time. All right. From the top. Okay. So now remember I'm a newbie, like total newbie, <laughs> just like many of my friends. So, so the first thing says, it's um, skin health and it's a skin brightening sheet mask. Yeah, so this is a nice little gift with purchase. And so basically this is a skin brightening sheet mask to brighten your mood and your skin. Ta-da! 
<laughs> and so basically leave it sealed up in like your bath water or a you know sink full of warm water just let the let the package get warm while it's still sealed okay. and then so you cleanse the skin and then you place the sheet mask on it's got little cute holes for your eyes nose mouth and then just basically you know lay out in the tub or whatever just give yourself a moment we all need a moment right now close the door, take some time for yourself because our balancing of our body, mind, spirit, energy, balancing, you know, the things of this world, our finances, our home life, our work life, everything, we still need to take time for ourselves. So this is just a little prompt to help you to do just that. I love that. I call that white space. Find your white space as, <laughs> as often as you can now. Um, is it better in the evening? Like if, if you take a bath in the evening or uh, in the morning or what? what Anytime. Anytime. And you can actually get two uses out of that little mask. Just seal it up, put it in the fridge, and then use it a couple days later. Excellent. Okay. In after, the fridge. Yeah, after you've used that mask, just put on like your facial moisturizer, um, then your sunscreen if it's during the day, and then if it's at night, put your moisturizer on and go to bed. Oh my gosh, I cannot. I can't. Well, super excited to do this. It's mm -hmm. been like a go, go, go period of time for me over the last few days and that might be one of the very first things that I do. You're gonna love it. I am gonna love it. Okay, here's the next one. So that is your exfoliant. So cleanser, moisturizer, sunscreen, scrub. So why don't you just pull everything out and then we'll go through everything in order. Excellent. And actually that order, I just learned something right now. <laughs> And this is basically your basic at-home routine. And then we're going to be integrating some other cool things into your routine with, say, your dermal rolling program that we're going to talk about next time. But this is step one. We don't want to overwhelm you. We want to keep things simple. So these are some products that I specially curated just for you based on what you told me about your skin. Uh, some of the products I work with, you won't be able to just buy on the e-store. They're, they are exclusive to you having a virtual consult because some of the brands, they actually require the aesthetic nurse or physician to actually meet with the, the client first and determine if it's a good fit. So that's why you'll, you'll see three of the brands that I work with, which are awesome on my e-store, but not all of them. And that's the reason why, because the medical grade brands want these products to be, um, you know, particular specifically laid out for people okay and and all of you rachel and i did talk before this and i did have a consultation and so that's your way in is you get to have a consultation with rachel um so that things can be customized right and because it's so important just yeah. like we're all chemically unique our skin is so unique as well yeah so let's start with your your cleanser there so you can hold that one up to the camera so everybody can see it okay hold on let me do it Right. Yeah, so that's the Sensi Calm. So this one is a really nice cleanser. It's a cream cleanser. If your skin's maybe just like a little bit on the sensitive side, yeah. um, there are lots of other cleansers I work with, some that are gel-based, some that are more for acne-prone skin. But this one's a really nice, calm, gentle cleanser. Would you use it twice a day or once a day? Twice a day. Okay, yeah. 101. Yeah. <laughs> twice a day, so just one pump in the morning? Yeah, get your hands a little bit moistened, a uh -huh. little pump or two in the morning, rub it all over, even your eyelids, your neck, your chest, the side of your neck too, and then rinse it off thoroughly. Okay. And then take your towel and make sure that you get like your edges of your hairline, your jawline. You don't need to completely dry your skin, but I do recommend that you dry those particular areas. Okay. All right. So this is the first thing. This is morning and evening. That's right. And I have to just say the container is so pretty. I love them. It's just really, everything here feels very, like, just very intentional and, um, and elegant, too. Well, this is medical grade. This is stuff that's backed by research. A lot of these product names you might not have heard about because these companies put more of an emphasis on their research and development over marketing. Yeah, which I, I just hands down appreciate. Yeah. Yes. For sure, it's so important, and, I, and I've fallen for the marketing in the past with like the oil of Olay's and everybody all has, and, yeah. right, right, for sure. We all have. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna start out my day with this, and um, what does it smell like, or what is it? Just there really actually isn't a smell to it. Well, that's probably a good thing, though, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. 
get your yeah. sense and like your intentional sense and in your diffusers and things like that. Love. Actually, that's such a great point because when you do have fragrances in these products, those fragrances are usually pretty questionable, right? Sometimes, yeah. So if a product I work with does have a fragrance, I actually check with the company to see what actually that fragrance has been made of. Okay. Because when a product says fragrance on the back of the bottle, it could be anything. It's basically their trade secret. Okay. Oh. Mm -hmm. So you have to actually inquire what's in it. Okay. Okay. All right. So that's number one. Um, what is the next one in that order? So Your first moisturizer. Order, the moisturizer right here. Yeah. So okay. this, this Amolia product uh, by Rejudicare, it's a really nice, just kind of daytime, nighttime moisturizer. It's great for most skin types. Okay. And it's sort of on like that mid lighter end of the moisture spectrum. I do have heavier base moisturizers, but for your skin type, this was going to be perfect. So there's a seal on it, but you do twist it to open it up. And it's got a number of really great little ingredients in it. Um, there's actually just a little bit of vitamin A and glycolic acid in this one, which is great because they're gentle exfoliants to the skin. So they're improving cellular turnover. It's moisturizing the skin. So that's a really nice kind of basic daytime moisturizer. The heavier version to that, I would say go for maybe like the Is Clinical Shield. And so just a little bit more expensive, but this is great. Like if you're going to be doing like resurfacing laser or options, things like that, or if your skin's more on the dry side. So a couple of, there's many different options. I have another option here, which is like a really good moisturizer. If you're acne prone, um, this is like a really good acne prone nighttime moisturizer, just tons of options, but okay. what I recommended for you. Okay. Awesome. And, um, and then how do you pronounce this one again? Rejudicare, Amolia. Okay. And then the synergy, I like it. Yeah. Awesome. So morning and night, and you can use it around your eyes, all the way to your eyelash lines. So you could use this as like your face cream, your night cream, your eye cream, your neck cream, your chest cream. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's going to help to uh, soothe the skin after at-home dermal rolling as well. Okay. Okay. And just one thing here, because some people might think, ah, who cares? I don't need a moisturizer or anything like that. And I'll tell you where I live, it's pretty dry. I live in Colorado. It's, it is definitely dry here. Um, I used to be that person. I used to be like, ah, I don't need anything. I can just, you know, and I know I'm going to love this because the skin just wants moisture, doesn't it? It sure does. Yeah. You want to be feeding your skin. So because this has got just like a little bit of glycolic and retinol, you're getting that steady dose of ingredients that are going to help with cell turnover, which is pretty awesome. Okay. And explain cell turnover just a little bit. Yeah. As we age, our cell turnover slows down a little bit. So for me in my thirties, my skin cell turnover is about a month. As we hit our 40s, 50s, 60s, it can go to like up to two months. It slows down a little bit. So basically by the time your skin cells at sort of like the base layer of your skin make its way up to the, the very superficial layer of your skin, which you actually see, mm -hmm. uh, depending on the time frame, the more time there is for those cells to make that journey, the more likelihood that they're going to be more pigmented or just not looking as vibrant. Oh, that's so fascinating. I like that stat of if you're in your 30s, the cell turnover is about 30 days. If you're in your 40s and beyond, then it's going to double and yes, at some point probably nice. triple. That is, that, oh my gosh, no wonder when you're in 20s, you're in your 20s, you look so amazing, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, fascinating. Okay, so that's the second. So the sunscreen is the third. That's right. And what's really cool about this one is this is actually one of my favorite sunscreens on the market. It's the mineral based sunscreen and I have mine uh, right here as well. So it's got zinc and titanium in it. A lot of sunscreens that I see people working with just have zinc and that's going to give it like that white cast. And this one has- I hate that white cast. Yeah. So this one is like tinted. And so if you look on here, it's a primer a sheer tint and a sunscreen and it's got antioxidants and it's talc free. So this oh is my gosh. not going to irritate your eyes or anything like that. This is amazing. This is amazing. So we, the sunscreen that we have at home right now does have the zinc and we walk around like white zombies, right? Just, <laughs> and it's, it's just, I hate it. And you know, my boys don't care so much. My husband does not care at all, but 
I do. I don't want to look like that. And I don't think that's superficial whatsoever. I think we're allowed to have preferences. And so I am super excited about this, especially because like you said, it's got the tint, but it also has antioxidants in it. I don't know any other sunscreens that are actually like infused with antioxidants. That's amazing. And it doesn't have talc and other agents that you don't want in your sunscreens, like chemical filters that actually mess with our hormones. They kill our coral reefs. So this is going to give you longer protection throughout the day. And it's not going to irritate your eyes, make your eyes sting. And it doesn't have that characteristic chemical sunscreen smell. Oh my gosh. Yes. So you were just um, like the benzones, right? The oxybenzones. Yep. So horrible for us. And they're like, they're in the sprays. They're, they're everywhere. Oh gosh, yeah. Yeah. Just so awful. I do my best to keep up with the latest research in skin and rejuvenation. And it's like a full-time job doing that. I'm teaching all the time. I'm consuming different courses myself all the time. So it's great to have someone kind of like me in your back pocket and I sift through the research and the latest data for you. Oh my gosh. I, like, yes, you call down like the most important information, which, which we need. I can't like, I can't be an expert in everything. Nobody can be an expert in everything. So we all need to rely on our team and we need to create our teams. And Rachel, mm -hmm. I am so happy that you are on my team. And, and when we think about wellness and well-being, we we want that, right? Like you want a doctor that you trust. You want to have a good dentist. You want to have, I believe the world would be a better place if everybody had a health coach as well, yeah. or some kind of life coach, somebody to help you focus on your dreams and make, or help you make sure that you're actually progressing towards them. Uh, and oh my gosh, to have a beauty coach, a beauty consultant, one that is board certified and has a nursing background as well is pretty amazing. I am super excited that you found this product because I never would have. Mm -hmm. And I no longer have to walk around with the, like the white cast. Yeah. So, yeah. so yeah. The, the reason you don't get that white cast is because this is, um, it's, it's micronized zinc. It's not nanoparticle or anything like that. It's micronized. So it's a really, really nice one. Oh my gosh. I bet that feels good going on too. Mm -hmm. Super smooth. It, has like a bit of like a silky type feel and it's going to help fill in your pores but it, because it's also a primer your makeup's going to go on brilliantly over top ah great point put the sunscreen on before you put the makeup that's right 101 <laughs> okay let's do this one now yeah, so that's scrub. It's the Zeo Micro Polish. And if you look on the back, it uses magnesium particles. You can actually just open it up. So it uses spherical magnesium particles to it, which is like the grit in the product, but it's not like a sugar, salt, or rice scrub, which can actually tear the skin and cause more uh, like, like superficial injury on the skin, which can lead to more reactivity. So a lot of times people with sensitive skin, they think, oh, I don't need to exfoliate actually the opposite they actually want to be getting the dirt oil debris pollution dead skin off product buildup off so that their skin's cleaner and then everything's going to absorb better it's so, pretty. so this is the only product that you have that does have a smell to it and so this one is scented with some essential oils oh it smells so good and the color is so calming actually one of my favorite colors yeah um my mom used to always think that um or she really liked the sugar scrubs and they just never really like, or the salt scrubs and never really resonated with me, but also the um, residue that they leave behind on the bathtub oh, in really? the shower is yeah. awful. So that one, um, it's, it does have quite a bit of like um, a polish grit feel to it. So just very light pressure. You need barely any of it, but I kind of call this one like a hydrofacial in a jar, which is a really, really nice exfoliation treatment that you can do in a clinic. Uh, but this is just a great affordable way to get a great exfoliation at home. Oh my gosh, that's, I can't wait to do this. So how often would you do the exfoliation? Two to five times a week. You know, you can do it at least five times a week. I know for me, I'm acne prone. I really need to up my exfoliation around that time of the month. Okay. And it's just great for those like random bumps to the forehead. If your skin's feeling a little dull, dry, flaky, do an exfoliation treatment like this and then your products, the moisturizer will just go on beautiful. Your skin's going to feel so much smoother. 
And this is really important to have on hand, especially if you're starting to incorporate things like retinol and dermal rolling, because you're going to get some irritation from it. It's kind of expected. And so I find when people, they work with me and they, you know, they're trying to do things that are in accordance with their budget, which is great. I work with people from all types of budgets, whether they're retirees and they're on a pension or, you know, the people want the best and the best. Most people I work with do have a specific budget that they need to work with. So I'll kind of help pare things down. But what I've noticed is that when people skimp on the um, exfoliating, and they start to incorporate like a vitamin A or a rolling, a dermal roller, which we're gonna talk about next time. They get uh, some like redness, flakiness, just like the skin doesn't feel so, so great. It's kind of rough. So having a good scrub like that one on hand is awesome. Mm, I can't wait to try, I'm gonna do this tonight. I, this is like perfect timing, I have to tell you. Um, Better in the evening or the morning? Does it matter? It doesn't matter. I'll, I'll do sometimes both. Okay. But what I will say in my experience, um, having worked with thousands of, of clients in a clinic setting, say I meet with someone, I do their in-clinic consult, I see them back about two weeks later for an in-clinic treatment, I see a difference in their skin already. They tell me that their skin feels smoother, it feels softer, because it's well-fed. You're just looking after it better. That diffuse redness starts to go away. Some of the clinical studies that actually Illumia MD has on their website is that it takes up to a month for us to really notice clinical changes, right? That's what the data shows, a month with using a routine. But what I see is, uh, you know, just a smoother, glassier type appearance in about two weeks. Oh my goodness. And that, I mean, in the grand scheme of things, that's nothing. Two weeks is nothing. Mm -hmm. uh, and just the peace of mind, knowing that you're nourishing your body in a really healthy, non-toxic way is such a big deal to me. Mm -hmm. uh, I put so much effort and intention into making sure I get good sleep, into making sure I have uh, kind of work through all my stress and making sure I eat well. That it is so, so time for me to now make sure that I take care of my skin. I mean... We could all say, gosh, I wish I could, you know, turn back time 30 years, 20 years, but because we can't, we can focus on what we have to work with today. And so I'm just so grateful, Rachel, like to know you and to um, work through these products. And I just know my, my skin is just going to love them and crave them probably. Yeah. Well, you're going to just be nourishing your skin. And the skin needs different things as you age. So from the 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, it's almost like each decade, the skin needs a few different things. So down the road, we're going to be incorporating dermal rolling with you with some vitamin serums and copper peptides, hyaluronic acids, all that. But keep things simple. We're all about simple, right? Oh, so yeah. Start with your basic routine for a little while, get your skin adjusted, then add in the actives, then add in dermal rolling, things like that. So basically this routine, if you're thinking, oh, can I afford this? Is this within my budget? Well, only you can answer that and do what's right for you. But obviously being able to make things available online is super handy right now because we can't get into the, the clinics or, or the shops. So I'm happy to help you out. But just as a reference, uh, the cost for this is well under 250 American. Oh my gosh, which is amazing because this is your, you're nourishing yourself but this is at least a month, right? A month supply probably. Yeah. So a lot of the products there are going to last you about two to three months. Oh my gosh. So two to three months, even longer. And here's the thing. Uh, I used to think, oh gosh, I don't want to spend money on clothes or I mean not clothes. I don't want to spend money on food. I don't want to spend money, you know, on, on hair care or skincare or anything like that because I wanted to spend it on clothing. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, that was, that was in my past. And then I realized, oh my gosh, like the clothing is, you can buy some very simple things, get some quality over quantity, but you don't need a lot. And I realized I wanted to take that into my life just overall. And so for the skincare, the body care, quality over quantity, you don't need a lot. Like you've just shown us, we don't need a lot. It's the same like buying organic or not. I'd rather buy organic foods and make sure I'm giving myself quality versus buying tons and tons of things. Mm -hmm. And I'm just really grateful for you taking the time, Heather, to really kind of share your journey. You know, you're not paid to 
talk about this with me or anything like that. You know, you just want to help people and other women that you work with as well. So what I offer is what's called educational entertainment. It's not medical advice. If you're unsure of what's best for you, you know, you do need to book a personal consultation to kind of learn which options might be right for you. And so I'm happy to help no matter where you are in the world. What lights me up is to connect with lovely ladies like yourself and men. I work with a lot of of male celebrities, actually. (laughs) Yes, there we go. The men men you talk to. Well, and I I just say, like, this is just, this is fun. And right now, I am trying to find my silver linings, Rachel. And when I find people that are good, that make me feel happy, that I enjoy connecting with, I want to share these people with my tribe because I want to spread the silver linings. And you, you are a silver lining right now. And so I, that's how I look at this. It's like, gosh, you have products that I believe in and they're quality and it's not complicated and you're a fun, engaging, wonderful person. And so a ray of sunshine. And so I'm just so glad that we've connected and become friends. And I feel like I'm paying it forward when I see something I really like and I know really resonates with me usually it really resonates with the people that are um following my my writings and my essays and my my summits and so forth so i just thank you for sharing your time and um you know if rachel resonates with you with which of course she does because rachel you are a delight uh just getting like doing the online consultation with you it's so great because we can see each other through video you can really connect with somebody and really feel like you're being heard and it's um the way i look at it is this self-care it's a gift it really is a gift for ourselves so often it's so easy to to give things to our kids you know or to our spouses and we forget to give things to ourselves and then it's um There's this book called uh, Gift from the Sea, and it's by Anne Merle Lindbergh. It was written in the 1950s, and it's so beautiful. Mm -hmm. And she talks about women back in the 50s, but it still holds true to today. Mm -hmm. Women will try and water a field, a whole field, with like a little little watering jug, and we never give back to ourselves. Mm -hmm. And so having a consultation with you, um, getting to understand my own skin better, was totally a gift to myself and it was a moment for me to slow down to pause and to say you know what i matter too and i can enjoy this and it's creating a spa like experience in your home when you can't leave your home right now so it's a silver lining and i hope you all go to rachelvarga.ca and use use my discount it's simply full one word s-i-m-p-l-y simply full f-u-l-l um that's 15 percent off right so i'm happy to pay that forward and to share you with everybody i know thank you rachel yeah my pleasure and one thing i just want to conclude on uh when you said self-care is a gift i would say it's actually an essential so you know, taking your time to, for yourself to really balance your body, mind, spirit, energy, whatever that might look like for you. A lot of ways to do that are actually free. And, you know, if you're, you're not really sure what that kind of means, you know, I talk about it all in the, you know, in my Rachel Varga podcast, you talk about that with you and, and how you work with women as well. But the thing, like when I'm looking at you speaking, it's like, you have that shine, you have that radiance. But guess what? You can't pay somebody to do that, right? Right. You got to cultivate that. You have to take the time to do that. And if you don't, you will have sort of more like that lackluster smile. So think about this. If you're, you're out doing something that you love or you're in a place of the world that you love, your smile is going to be so much better than, you know, if you're stuck somewhere where you're just not feeling good you're not looking after yourself you're really not looking you're not listening to those um inner and outer uh, skin beauty health cues your smile is not going to be the same so you know this is the more sort of like superficial skin stuff but what it kind of opens men and women up to is they start with you know their skin because they they see things changing in their skin they're like oh well why do I have more pigment? Why do I have more skin irritation? 
what else is my body trying to tell me on a health level? You can do all of the things internally by working with functional medicine practitioners, doing you know, gut, genetic analysis, labs, things like that. But your skin does need separate care as well. And I really do my best to work with companies that take good care of their employees, that really put an emphasis in making good products and researching their products. I love to support you know, locally made products as well by other amazing women that just want to help support people as well. So I really do my part, I feel like, to you know, support some really great companies out there as well. Uh, and that's what makes the world go around. I love the intentionality. And uh, you're right, it's, it's not a gift, it's essential, but we need to give ourselves the gift to realize it's essential. And, um, and I just think, gosh, what a gift you are in my life, Rachel. Thank you so much for doing this. My and pleasure. thank you so much for doing this for my tribe. I really appreciate it. Yeah, of course, of course. And, you know, give us some love. You can find Heather at yeah, Root of Root, Wellbeing. Exactly, Root of Wellbeing. So some of you only follow my essays online and so forth, but I do try to be active on Facebook and Instagram, Root of Wellbeing, and Rachel at Rachel Varga official. So take a screenshot of you either listening to this podcast or watching the video on uh, my YouTube channel and, or in your, your wonderful Facebook group with your community and just send us some love. Let me know what questions you have. Just reach out. I don't have, a, you know, some assistant reading my emails and DMs. I do that. So they have. <laughs> we're real. <laughs> Yeah, we're, real we're real and we love what we do and we want to pay it forward yeah and this is how we we light ourselves up is by connecting especially during this time more than ever uh, but just do what's right for you if things aren't in alignment with budget right now then you know just wait a little while but do start to make smarter purchasing decisions with your products and don't just go with oh my gosh i'm seeing all these skincare products on sale right now like a lovely lady I just did a consultation for. She's like, oh, I heard a really good thing about this serum and that serum and all these and all these brands are doing big sales right now. But I mean, she bought like two antioxidant serums that she didn't need when she could have uh, had one that's got your C E and peptides. Right? Right. Right. It's not it's not a quantity thing. It's definitely it's like the best quality you can. There's a saying, um, less but better. Yeah. And it's the idea of and and, and then it's because sometimes with minimalism it's like oh you know is that like because I'm, I'm an inspiring minimalist but it's the idea is like oh is the goal not to buy at all and I'm like no I, I, I don't want our, my, my country the United States to go into a depression or our continent and so I definitely believe in buying I just believe in buying better mm -hmm. and more intentionally yeah a lot of people are starting to clue into that and just being smarter consumers and I think that's one of the silver linings in this is that people are going to be just going for a better quality. They're really going to be looking at who they're supporting at this time and having less, I, I've, I bet we're making less garbage right now too, <laughs> which is awesome. Yeah. So I can't yeah. wait to, you know, do step two with you when your dermal roller arrives and I'll kind of walk you through how to do that. But just, you know, get your skin ready with your, with your basic routine now. And then it's just baby steps starting to incorporate the other actives, which I will guide you on. I am so excited to have a more intentional routine. This is more quiet time just for myself, but the door shut and the chaos outside the door. And this is just me in the bathroom with my with my self-care. I love it. Thank you, Rachel. My pleasure. Thanks so much for, you know, asking me to guide you during this time and get you set up with a nice, simple, yet very effective routine that was cultivated and customized just for you. I'm so happy. I'm starting it tonight. <laughs> yes. All right, everybody. We will see you in the next episode. Bye.